Howdy everyone. This is the second day working on this piece. Um, I've gotten it mostly down to shape. This is a piece of you. Um, and you'll see on here, there's a few little cracks. That's probably hard to see there. There's a small one. Uh, but, you know, the primary one is this one right here. It runs all the way up and goes down about an inch at least. So I need to repair that before I can turn more on this. This crack here as well. It's just starting to show up. So I'm going to um, yeah, do a little work on these. The smallest ones I'll probably just throw some sawdust in with some CA glue. This bigger one, I'm not sure. I might try adding some um, pigment to that. And maybe just try the polycolor um, metallic blue that I have with CA glue. I've never tried that, so maybe I should try an experiment first to see if it actually will um, harden normally <laughs> before I throw it into this piece. So I'll, I'll give that a try and then um, bring you back when I'm working on these cracks. So test one was uh, some medium CA glue with some polycolor um, resin powder. And I don't know if you can see that very well, but it basically just clumped up immediately and um, hardened into chunks. So that's a non-starter. So next I'll try maybe some uh, Aluma Dust, slightly different product, and see if that works any better. So I used some purple Aluma Dust, um, and well, it's hardening now, but it was workable for... 10, 15 seconds, maybe a reasonable amount of time. Um, so that that might work. That might be usable. Uh, this purple Aluma dust is pretty cool. It's a nice color. All right, I think what I'm going to try is the purple Aluma dust, but um, I'm not going to pre-mix it. I think what I'm going to do is put some thin CA glue in here, maybe put a tape boundary on here. Put some thin CA um, and then sprinkle Aluma dust in there and just keep repeating that process, um, building up layers and hope for the best.
so far so good pretty happy with the way this uh, Luma dust came out it's nice and smooth and uh, filled in nicely I see when I turn the inside if there's gaps on the other side um, so far I've just put shine juice on here looks like it's absorbing it pretty well so I might I'm gonna let this sit till tomorrow and then we'll see I might come in with a final coat of shellac but yeah overall it's looking really good it's got some pretty grain some nice little features like this one and then this purple a little bit of purple here so far so good I'm liking it <laughs>